This is an exciting time because finally it looks like we may be able to reform our immigration system. And uh, I think uh, there are a few ingredients that we will need to put into the new policies in order for them to work best in terms of the interest of the American economy and society. One is we should try to make the system a little simpler. It's very convoluted now. It's very disconnected between temporary visa and permanent visa. So a little more simplicity with that. The second is it should be a little bit more labor market driven. Uh, so respond to the need of employer when there is a high demand in period of boom, we should increase the number of immigrants that we uh, allow in. And when it decreases, we may decrease it. And third, uh, we should find a way for uh, legal status to the undocumented uh, who are currently here. All three of these measures will increase the positive impact of immigrants. Immigrants come here mostly to work in large part and to contribute to the labor market and productivity. And this has been a trend which has been going on in the last 20, 30 years. So projecting forward, this would be the major benefit that we have for immigration, allowing people who are motivated, who are willing to work, who have employer who wants to hire, allowing them to come in legally and uh, uh, stay and contribute to the American society. And finally, start to incorporate fully those 11 million of undocumented who are here, but they're not participating fully because of this anomaly of their status. So that will also boost the economy in the next 10 years as these people uh, feel more attached, invest more in their education, in their training. They can finally move across jobs and find the jobs that best matches their skill. All these will increase their productivity and their, and their contribution to the American economies as a consequence. And uh, so I would say that the biggest benef benefits of both uh, these uh, immigration reform and allowing the undocumented to have a full part is going to be unraveled in the next 10 to 20 years, contributing to the growth of the economy.